it's disgusting as it is, those are all actually from the show. Like, those are all used. Hey! This one's actually one of our favorite parts. <laughs> it came to you like this? Oh, yeah. Uh, right here is from the Purple Pills music video. Eminem. Yeah. Hot down the bubble down earth, but nothing compares to these blue and yellow purple pills. This is the DEA agent's car from Breaking Bad. <laughs> wow. See the truck behind it, it's from Twister. Oh, that movie? Yeah. Dude, I love that movie. This is one of the best movies they ever made. It's starting to turn. Where? I can't see it. Next to it is a George Barris custom Pinto. George Barris Pinto. King of custom. Uh, van next to it is from Cable Guy. If you look at the roof, they cut out the roof for camera equipment and they just kind of spot welded it back on. Yeah, I see that. Uh, behind that, you got a Gotham police car. And the Gotham TV show. Uh, next to that, we got another detective car from Gotham. Uh, that van is from The Sopranos. Sopranos minivan. This was in every episode of The Ranch. Yeah. Uh, these were the cars that crashed in the Monaco scene of Iron Man 2. Uh, Whiplash cuts the car in half and these cars kind of wreck in the background. What about this uh, Ford over here? That one was in Clint Eastwood's newest movie, Cry Macho, and it was also in Ford vs. Ferrari for the assembly scene. So you'll see a Ford Falcon in every stage of production in the movie, Ford vs. Ferrari. Yeah. This was the one at the very end. This now, is the final one? Yeah, it might look kind of rough, but if you like took a pressure washer to it, this is all fake dirt. Oh, it's so fake? This is like a brand new restored Ford Falcon. I don't know if it's unlocked. It looks like it is. Brand new interior in it. Oh my gosh. Hey. This one's actually one of our favorite parts. So why's it got fake dirt on it? Uh, in the Clint Eastwood movie, he was driving through the desert. Kind of helps give it that look. Are you gonna pressure wash it or keep it like this? I kind of like it like this. I like the patina. Wow. Far that's abandoned on the side of the road and falling down. This was in falling down. Yeah, just like when he has the mental breakdown in LA traffic. It looks like you guys have left it here too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's this bus over here? So that was used in Rob Zombie's movie. I think it's called 31, but it was a horror movie about Hmm. Happy time fun show. Venus Virgo. Almost just fell. Slippery. What about this thing? Can I see in the Pussycats van? The original one. Wow. Obviously needs some restoration, but that's kind of the story with everything around here. Pretty cool. What about this? This was from Better Call Saul. It was shoved off a cliff, shot up. You can tell it's the one from that because of the odd colored door back here. Yeah. Uh, but it's got the bullet holes in it, the broken glass. And uh, this thing was that is kind a of ton a painting of dirt. <laughs> It came to you like this? Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, was, uh, we actually had to ratchet strap the front of the car to the Suburban over here and we literally just drove the truck forward and let it fall off because we couldn't get it off. We tried pushing it off. How'd they get it on? Winch. <laughs> How much is a car like this worth? Uh, you know, to, uh, to a normal person, not much, but to a museum, they'd pay good money for a movie distressed car. You know? so it's kind of hard to put a price on. Wow. <laughs> Look at the roof. I mean, look at the tire. That is properly shredded. This this would be on Copart. That's totaled. No. Loss. Total loss. The Barris Pinto. That truck is so cool. Wow. The one back here in the trees belonged to Frank Sinatra, and they also used it in American Folk. This was Frank Sinatra's van. 
is personally used by him. We had it out at the museum for a while, and unfortunately some crackheads had broken in and it came out to the project warehouse. It's a shame. What about this wagon? Uh, that was actually used in Supernatural. Uh, I think it was used by Pestilence, because you can see all the rags. Those are actually, as disgusting as it is, those are all actually from the show. Like, those are all used props. There's, uh, look like to be plants growing into the car. Yeah, I think that's just because someone shut the door on them. Oh, okay. Sink and turd. Sick and tired. Sick and tired. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, someone just shut the door in it. Our, uh, mower hadn't come out. What about this submarine type? Dead Sea Donuts? Yeah, so that's based on a VW Vanagon. It was used in Legion. It's like an X-Men show. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's what I'm about. Hmm. Is that everything in this slot? Oh, I have one more. One more you're gonna get a kick out of. Coming around the corner, what is this? This is one of the people hidden. What the heck? <laughs> Dodge Caravan mixed with a... A Suzuki Esteem. Or a Hyundai Esteem, it's one of those two. Um, so this is actually the camera car for a better call Saul. So anytime you see him driving mm -hmm. the uh, Suzuki, it's actually him in here. The camera crew would sit in the back. And uh, interesting enough, when we got this car, we opened the door and there's a little human turd sitting there. <laughs> Who? Yeah, someone had pooped in the car. It was like a thank you gift for buying the car, I guess. I was kind of mad when I saw this show up because I don't like things going out to the project warehouse. Yeah. But, you know, it's... That's disgusting. You clean it out or is yeah, it... Yeah. This car got a deep cleaning inside and it needs one outside too, but... So this was the film car for the car that was over there that got shot off the cliff. Yeah, so you notice that it was yellow. The yeah. The car was yellow. This has the yellow hood because they shoot the, they shoot the scene from like here mm -hmm. or from inside of the cab where the caravan pieces are. So it still okay. looks like a yellow car from here. Yeah. That's why they didn't even care about these guys. That's why they didn't even paint them. Wow. So a little bit of movie magic for you. It's literally spot welded and bonded together. Yeah, that is... Yeah. Uh, and we did, this is a running driving car, it's very drivable, unfortunately. Very drivable, unfortunately. Hmm. What a collection. And, uh, we wouldn't mind clearing up some space up here. Uh, we talked about getting rid of some of these so we can focus on some of the cars inside. Yeah. But we, we really don't like sending cars out here to sit. Yeah. And we don't have the mechanics for them. Either, so if anyone's interested in this thing's pretty cool. Yeah, it's actually uh, inside. It's got all the creepy props and stuff in it. This dress. If I uh, watch this show, I'm sure I'd appreciate it a lot more. Probably. The show must go on. Have you watched it? I've not. What other props? Can we see anything? Uh, I mean, it's just this dress on the inside. Like, uh, it had some creepy posters and stuff in there. Oh yeah, some weird, weird stuff. It's actually in pretty good condition, but uh, a lot of times they just turn space to make it look like that. Uh, six wheels, wow. Yeah, basically a G-Lag and six wheels. <laughs> Which is your favorite car out of this lot? Outside? Yeah. Falcon. I love that car. Actually, I drove that out here, no tags, no insurance, on a whim. I didn't even know how much gas it had, but <laughs> it, it drove nice. Which of these ones would you save? Uh, honestly, that F-250 right there. I like the patina look of the old F-250s. Yeah. And the fact that <clears throat> it's got the McQueen history behind it and the bullet spec, I think that's a killer car. I would probably save the uh, truck in the very back with the camper. Really? Yeah. What was we that actually, from again? That was from Twister. Twister. Uh, we bought it from Planet Hollywood. It doesn't have an engine or transmission. That's the only reason it's out here. Dang. So. I like that. We actually do want to get that running and driving again. It's kind of important to movie history. Yeah. All right, Dev. Give us a collection tour of these Fast and Furious cars.
Oh